So we've, we've had an interest, I personally have an interest in uh, fibro lamella for some time. Uh, we've had some discussions with uh, Dr. Abu Alpha uh, for many years. Um, uh, as was explained earlier this evening, we've got a, a trial running, so-called basket trial, a summit trial, uh, which is looking at, uh, is true personalized medicine, looking at uh, neuratinib in uh, tumors with HER2 mutations. And um, as the construct of that uh, study was, uh, was discussed earlier today, it lends itself to um, the sorts of um, uh, niche indications that fibromella represents, these small, uh, rare tumors, um, may, uh, ideally with, a, with, a, with a, a very specific biomarker or target to go after. Um, and uh, it's, it's, it's an area that uh, we could easily adapt an ongoing trial that we have to uh, uh, an orphan disease such as fibromyalgia. Well, it's uh, one of the biggest hurdles is really just getting the um, uh, the comfort level around neuratinib beyond or outside the, the, the breast cancer community. Neuratinib has been in development in breast cancer for a long time. So breast cancer physicians, breast cancer oncologists uh, are pretty familiar with it and, and accepting and understanding of the activity uh, in breast cancer. But outside the field of breast cancer, it's a relatively unknown quantity. And so that's the biggest hurdle now is, is um, uh, translating that activity which the breast cancer community has brought into for many, many years, not just with physicians, but with nurses, caregivers, nurse navigators, and patients and advocacy groups, uh, translating that activity into, into other areas where there could be potential.